Hey people, what's up y'all? Uh, so today uh, we will talk a little bit uh, how to create a logo, especially with Wix Logo Maker. So um, I'm not a professional, but to be honest, uh, actually I would love to share you with my experience and uh, actually I would love to show you how you can create very easy uh, logo just in even in one minute. So it's very simple to be honest. Uh, so uh, let's start. Actually, Wix Logo Maker is uh, unique because, you know, it doesn't send you straight to the builder. Uh, in fact, you're asked several questions to get an idea, actually the whole idea of your brand culture and what you're going to be selling. Therefore, the process starts by asking you some simple questions that make no, they take no more than five minutes to complete. For instance, one of the questions is, for example, what describes your brand? Yeah. Uh, after, you need to uh, actually select uh, it's it's just just look like like and dislike yep yeah? uh, you uh, will be shown a handful uh, of uh, designs to see exactly what type of style you're into yep yeah? uh, and you just need to select the ones that you like what uh, actually uh, you can do uh, directly right here and clicking directly to the bottom start now we will start our journey on which for your maker so I'm actually here you have two ways uh, of uh, your uh, just how you can create your logo. Yep, you can hire a professional or create a logo by yourself. Uh, so you can hire a professional, I would say, in that case, if you don't have a free time or if you don't have any desire. Uh, so it's not interesting for you, but you just need a logo. So that's option is directly for you. But if you would like to create a logo to be involved in the process, to control each detail, yep, uh, to try to play around with the editor, so that option is directly for you. And we will uh, actually uh, today work with the editor. So basically, we will create a logo by ourselves. The next, uh, what will be the question? Uh, start designing your logo and we need uh, to add the name of the business or organization. I don't have any business, I don't have any organizations, but just for an example, I just need to think about uh, what, uh, for what actually will be a logo and actually I need to fill the name of my brand. So I guess let it be related with a clothing store why not so um the name of my brand will be <laughs> okay let it be uh john's i, I don't know why john's but let it be let it be just drums and that's all okay please don't judge me okay what's your logo for my logo for will be for clothing brand clothing store yeah okay closing okay shop the next and I adore this part because I need to uh, actually highlight uh, the keywords yep yeah how uh, my logo should look like. So uh, it should be modern, it should be hipster, it should be crash, I would say, okay. And um, this is my lovely part, I would say here we need to make fast decisions. Uh, what of this variance uh, for me is better that it looks like, okay. Hmm. Okay, don't like, I don't like. Okay, let it be like this one for social media, for websites, for business cards, for presentations, for uh, merchandise and others, okay. So right now it analyzes my responses and it uh, uh, actually this, this service, the logo, a Wix logo maker will provide me uh, actually like uh, this. <laughs> cool logos and to be honest this one is cool this one is cool but i should say that this one is better like jones yeah okay pretty cool so if you don't like for example none of them you may play around uh you can 
upload not upload you can uh, to see the other ones for example that's cool yeah mm, okay let's um see a little bit more this element is really funny to be honest okay so uh first of all one that i like the most uh, is this one because of the font yeah and um, actually i guess that this is really nice it looks not um, nice and uh, for example it's just like a minimalism yep uh the only thing i would love to add is just maybe the elements but this is actually the editor uh you don't you, you don't need to know the rules how to work how to use it with the actual this editor because it's very simple it's intuitive if you know how to work with the wix website builder editor so for you it's uh help i would say of a job yeah and um actually uh this is the editor uh on the left side you have panel tools panel uh first is responsible for color palette so you will work with the colors you may play around yeah with this one basically that is how uh they looks like yeah uh, but to be honest i would love to save uh, the first variant because i i really like it okay the next button is responsible for the text and if you don't like the phone but in my case i will save the phone uh so clicking directly to the bottom of add text you uh will uh you actually can change the alignment you can change the size you can change even text opacity but okay here we have add your text no i don't want to add my text so um uh here yeah uh, you can change the alignment the color uh you can change the position mm, i would say you can add a shadow or even a blur and uh the elements is responsible of course for uh, this section is of course responsible for the elements and we can add some of uh, these elements and i want to find something special okay and uh, it may be just it may look directly just right here i would say oh um, actually that's all you can uh, actually play around you may um just locate right here maybe just directly yeah and make it smaller but i guess that this uh, in this case it looks better and of course uh clicking directly to the bottom next because i think that that's all yeah and you can see that it's look i guess that it looks pretty good to be honest uh okay so this is the samples uh what i can say you can use uh actually this element as a sample so this is not for a full commercial use but you have two options i just need a lego or get my lego plus a website actually these are two plans and um I just need a logo or just logo. This is a basic plan that gives you full commercial usage rights for your logo and was so called standard logo files. Yep, you will have two PNGs in your original logo, uh, I mean in colors. You will have two PNGs in black, two PNGs in white, one PNG in grayscale, and of course, one PNG in monochrome. One thing I like the most is that all of these PNGs, they have transparent background and it's very important because uh, the transparency will allow you to place your logo over any background, including uh, image, for example, without a weird or a distracting shape surrounding it. Yep. Uh, so uh, it's really cool and this plan is fine if you, uh, for example, 
only will display your logo online, I would say, yeah, uh, for a Facebook profile or for social media profiles. It really co looks cool, I would say, and, you know, um, advanced uh, logo plan which includes some extra useful files for printing editing and social media display so uh, you will get all the same commercial rights and standard uh, I would say logo files and the basic plan of course and you will get more than 40 logo versions that have been precise for various social media platforms uh, such as Facebook Instagram Twitter um uh, linkedin in different colors so actually it's really cool option and um the premium plans logo plus a website so actually this plan gives you the standard logo files uh apg semis uh, just in basic logo um just logo basic plan yep so uh actually uh the wix i would say website plan i would say it's combo plan uh, it uh, has uh, up to 3 gigabytes of storage, up to 2 gigabytes of bandwidth, a free custom domain for one year. And uh, this actually plan will be good for, uh, <laughs> let me think about it. Uh, for example, in that case, if you need to build a website, of course, you don't have any website and just you need to uh, create uh, a perfect website with a logo to uh make your brand so that actually op option is directly for you and of course you just like for e-commerce functionality or where there will be a lot of reuse a lot of uh, elements visual aspects so that will be directly for you um you may ask me uh why actually you should consider wix uh, over the others yep uh, i can say that uh, it's integrated with the wix platform so if you are already running a site on wix it makes sense to keep all of your tools under uh, one roof, you know? And this uh, way you can quickly transfer the logo to your Wix website. In addition, the logo uh, makes it built to match your logo design to the current branding of your website and vice versa. So you are more likely to establish a recognizable brand with similar colors, fonts and icons. And finally, the Wix customer service resources uh, are already established and ready for you to use. Yep, the company isn't known for its, uh, I would say, support, uh, but you know, the online resources are the best in the business and therefore you can go to the blog knowledge base and learn all about designing your logo while also checking in uh some tips for your website it's really nice some people i really do hope that this video episode was interesting for you and maybe it was helpful i will cross my fingers for that and as usual i'm waiting for your comments i'm waiting for your likes i'm waiting for your shares uh, have you ever tested wix logo maker or not what do you think about wix website builder editor and what do you think about wix uh logo maker would you like to try it or not? I'm waiting for your comments and I would like to thank you uh, and see each other in another video episode. Wish you good luck, good vibes and bye.